Hello, Happy New Year everyone. I've been meaning to do a video for a while and um, I'm still on Insta a lot but not as much on here. So I hope everyone's having a great start to the new year and uh, I thought I'd show you some of the Valentine's Day bits that arrived today. As you can see at the front here we've got the love bug and this smells of sweets to me fizzy sweets and it's a really gorgeous scent and I'm sure my son will appreciate this as you can see it's a really um, lovely design of a car and it has things like Sicilian lemon oil in organic sweet orange oil rose oil and um, yes it just smells really lovely and really refreshing but gorgeous and sweet and here we have the year of the tiger and this one it's called Lucky Tiger and it's for the year of the tiger, should I say. And this one is in the Karma scent, which is orange patchouli. It's very rich and spicy and a lot of people have tried it. But if you haven't and you love a good orange scent, you'll really enjoy this. It has, I'll say, some of the extra things. It has Siberian fir needle oil, lemongrass oil, lavandin oil. And it's just a gorgeous, strong orange orangey rich scent to my nose really powerful and I was actually uh, my date my year of birth is the year of the tiger so definitely going to try that one and here we have Kim the carrot in this shape that is a mixture of carrot and something else and this says a bunch of candy sweet bubbles it says it has benzoin res or benzoin resinoid and uh, vanilla absolute, fresh carrot juice, ginger root and to my nose it's really sweet and really vanilla-y. At first I thought I smelled like a chocolate element to it but I think it's just this, it reminds me of creamy candy in a vanilla chocolate. That's the sort of scent I'm getting from it. Let me smell it again. Yeah, that's really nice. It's got a, almost like that brightness to it as well even though it's a very sweet scent and oh lower right we've got the rose soap which as you can see it's new to me and I can't even remember the name it says new rose skin softening floral delight I can't pick up much of a scent on this at all at the moment I'm really hoping it's curing or some sort of delicate rose scent comes out of it but at the moment I can't smell much to be honest that's how it looks but it's uh, just a really faint fragrance. Um, well, I, I, as I say, I can't really even smell anything yet. So fingers crossed it, something comes out of it when it's actually being used. It actually feels ni already nice and moisturising to the touch. So I'm just hoping, as I say, there'll be a scent to that. And what else are we looking at? Um, uh, I wanted to try the can't resist everything but temptation shower gel and this says red apple and it's almost it reminds me it's really tart and so it's a really tart apple scent it's, there's a real greenness to it and uh, I'll be interested to see if everyone smells this with theirs but it's almost like uh, it's a tart and you know the apple peel I'm trying to explain it but it's it's not uh, got much sweetness to it so it's a very green tart scent so if you actually prefer that you will probably really enjoy that now up here we have got the big aubergine now as you can see this is absolutely huge um if that's the usual bath bomb this is going to be an amazing amazing bath and uh I'm looking forward to having this one because it's it smells gorgeous. It's basically the, um, when I was smelling it at first, I was thinking this is sweet and floral. It's got a bit of fruitiness to it. And then I realised it's, I think, the 29 High Street scent. don't know if it says that, sorry. It just says, supersize your bath time. And it says it has Hoewood oil, Litsia Kabiba, Tonka Absolute, um, Bergamot and... The actual scent to me is the 29 High Street. So if you smell that, it is literally a mixture of sweet, floral, fruity and smells like the shop. So it's going to be a powerful one because, as you can see, it's huge. And um, that's the 
Valentine's Day bits. I think I've said the ones um, that I've got to try here. I didn't get the lobster, which actually looked really cute, but it had almond oil in. And I didn't get the lip mask because that had almond oil in too. But I thought while I was here, I'd also show you the bits and bobs from the Boxing Day sale. And uh, I managed to get online in the end. I was checking then because uh, it took a few days for the sale to actually uh, come around. So before that, I popped in and got a couple of things at my local Lush. And um, I think they're actually in the bag there. And I've used lots of them already. Um, and these are the ones... I ordered online the cinnamon roll because of course that's the hot toddy scent which is a really really gorgeous warming fragrance and cinnamon and just everything you imagine in a Christmas scent but really strong as well and spicy and then I got one of the uh, bath time favorites so I hadn't bought much Christmas stuff I think I might have put a picture up on Instagram of some of it don't know if I did anything on here I can't even remember but that's quite a nice set to have because uh, um, as I said I didn't go mad uh, this year and uh, I've been just enjoying lots of perfumes as well so and uh, other companies too but um, I always uh, enjoy Lush Bath and that doesn't uh, seem to change so <laughs> these are the latest ones that I uh, got I hope, as I said, I hope I said earlier that I hope everyone's well. And um, as I say each time, there's so many things I want to actually chat about and show, scent-wise, because uh, I still really enjoy um, fragrances, perfumes, etc. But I've actually just got to try and make the time to do that. I'd love to do more ASMR videos in the evening, but sometimes my son is quite loud as he falls asleep and. Um, when he's a bit more settled um, I might try again because uh, they're just nice and relaxing to do and a nice chance to talk about fragrance. Anyway I better go I'll try and do some demos as usual and um, try them over the weekend and happy Friday everyone take care bye